This is a question for you, Alice. What made you decide to direct this film? When I was a child, running in the night, afraid of what might be. I think the only reason to make a movie is if you can't help it. I love your series so much. It's, it's wow. incredible. Um, and I understand that it caused some controversy when it came out in Israel. Tell me about that. I think at first, at first, uh, they don't. We're not used to to having like thrillers in Hebrew, and when it went out, when it came out, and and all the 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 surrounding was from looks like from from another uh, another dimension. People people were like, "What's going on? This is our our actors in our language, and and it's 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 a thriller." But then we we had this amazing uh, femme fatale here, just sucking the, the air out of everything. Yeah. Alice Kinoa, right? I've been wondering where you went. Lee, the moment that you met um, uh, I had Ayelet's character in the train, you gave off this vibe immediately, this vibe of danger being on edge. How do you get to that state without a, without a run up to it, without, you know, introductory scenes? How do you just get to that pitch? Um, I think that, you know, we had, I, I had a lot of additions and a lot of callbacks and we had a lot of work um, about that scene. I mean, that scene actually was the audition scene in the train. And wow. That, yeah, and that's the first scene that Sigal wrote for the whole, whole series. So she knew <clears throat> exactly what she wants. And so while the audition, the audition, so I worked, I all the time had to, to the chance to work on the scene, you know, mm -hmm. and to work on the character at the scene. So yeah, it's really important scene because it's the first uh, scene of, of, uh, of Sophie and uh, Who's who's that character and what what does she want? It's like uh, she's good, she's bad. And I read the script and uh, I just didn't have a choice. It was an act of survival for me. You know, she uses her body sitting in a train in ways you don't often see people doing that. So I mean, that's sort of an immediate indicator. Now, did you judge her at all as a person? I think yeah. I think I I, I was judge her and uh, and I was I was judgmental about her because because uh, until like Sigal uh, didn't let me read the script like uh, until until some point you know and I, all the time I I all the time saying to her I I have to know the end because if I won't know the end so I can't play the whole the whole series you know. So when she let me know the end, so I, I finally had like, oh, okay, so that's why she's so crazy. So that's why, <laughs> and yeah, it that's helped me. I don't believe anyone who says you can have it all. Don't let me go. Because you can't. Sigal, so, I want to say that this film is quite revolutionary. Uh, and I hear it was there was you know was controversial when it came out in Israel. It's a film about women. It's a very profound film, um, made by women, and dominated by women. And I just love to see that. And in a way, it's a milestone. So congratulations. Was that part of your thinking? Thank you. Um, yes, it was. Uh, uh, my crew was also fifty percent female, which is very rare. And you know the the. The characters, I think, uh, e even beyond the leads, I mean, uh, the mother-in-law, the producer, the the homeless woman, you know, the, all, the, we're seeing very different uh, perspectives and flaws and women who, you know, decided to live their life in a certain way. And, you know, that was all part of the part of the world kind of that I, I wanted to create. And sometimes people you love. It's coming for me through the dream. 
I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, um, you're in just about in every frame of this film. And, you know, it's, as we said, it's very complex and it's tightly wound, very tightly wound story and fast paced. In terms of difficulty, where would you rate this as an acting job? <laughs> Um, the, the, this role for me is a really meaningful role. And I think probably one of my top three jobs performances of my life because of not only the, the depth, but also the experience, the actual artistic experience around it. Um, and I think it's not very common to get, uh, to play something so profound and especially around around Alice I only when I saw the edit is when I realized the journey you know and how deep it is and and how you know um subconscious and how much you see when the camera sits and and um revealing it is about you know the experience of being a woman a, an artist woman artist and a mother a wife a friend it's all there. It's just a terrific series. Thank you so much, ladies. Congratulations. Sometimes the people you love get hurt on the way. I guess it's all part of the ride. You can pray to God that it will be worth it at the end. Do you think it was worth it?